So it's three o'clock in the morning on Tuesday, day after Labor Day. I don't really know the day, like the actual date, but it's day after Labor Day. And uh, I'm just lying here about to go to sleep because I couldn't sleep. And um, because I had really bad acid in my throat and then my throat started hurting, I was just having issues. I'm finally okay enough to go to sleep and then there was this giant boom that like shook my house and then the power went off there is no power I have no power my parents have power at their house because I called my brother this is my source of light this lovely candle I had to go run to the back of the building to make sure my dad's place wasn't on fire I don't think it was because all I can smell is the paint so I'm kind of just like freaking out and I don't know what to do and my parents won't answer their phone. I'm so my brother ended up going wake up my parents and um, my dad just pulled up so I don't know what he's, he's been out there for like three minutes now so I don't know what's going on. <coughs> um, I, I have no idea so alright. So my dad talked to the energy people and apparently it's just the side of the highway and um, they're going to send somebody in a couple of hours to fix it. So hopefully, you know, it can be fixed right away and not like in three or four days or something. I don't know, but um, I have about 90% battery life. On my phone. It's about uh, 3 30, almost 4 o'clock. <sighs> yeah. I'm gonna try to get some sleep. I'm trying to not get too overheated. I mean, <clears throat> no one really wants to have no power in the middle of, you know, the hottest part of the year in South Louisiana. So, it's wonderful. But, um, we're doing okay, and, uh, yeah, so, I, I hate to have to blow out this candle, but I think I'm gonna have to blow it out, but then I'm gonna have, like, no light, and I hate not having a light to sleep with, because I, I was always terrified to not have a light to sleep with when I was younger, because I would wake up in the middle of the night not breathing, and if there was no light, I would think I was dead. So, like, ever since I was little, I've always had to have a light. So, this is the first time I'm, like, alone in the middle of a power outage. I mean, I have Ava, but it's, it's kind of freaky. <laughs> um, <clears throat> my dad left, so it's just me and Ava. And, yeah, I think I'm gonna go try to get some rest. Don't know how it's gonna happen, but we can try, right? <laughs> so I'll see you guys either when something else happens or when the power comes back on or um just yeah, sometime in the future. And we did get the electricity back on. I'm not sure about what time because I did fall asleep, but by the time I woke up, <coughs> the electricity was on, so that was sorted out. I guess it was a transformer that blew that was close to my place. That's what the shaking of the building was about, maybe? I don't know. But, yeah. So, I now have power! It's wonderful. So, I didn't really film the rest of today. Um, I ended up sleeping a lot later than usual because I was up until like 6 o'clock dealing with all of the electricity stuff. Um, but with all of that being said, I did have an okay day. I was very kind of lethargic though and my joints were really bothering me, but breathing wise I was doing okay until about eight, nine o'clock-ish, um, then my sinuses started acting up. I think I'm coming down with a cold or something. <coughs> My cough is getting worse. Um, 
I'm more productive each time I cough. It, it's very strange. I don't know. But I'm constantly having a tickle in my throat. And my throat was really sore all night. Mm -hmm. um, so, I really don't know what that's about. Um, I might call in to get some antibiotics or something tomorrow. And, um, yeah, so it, things have just been really strange. I don't know if it's CF sick or if it's just the RKMB stuff isn't getting better or if I'm getting actual sick. <coughs> but I don't know. I don't. I don't know. So I guess we'll see what I'm like in the morning, but I'm going to go finish up my vest and get to bed and I will see you guys tomorrow.